Let's take a look at our magic loop. Here's a magical bridge, but it just doesn't quite go far enough. In order to repair this, we're going to need to modify the code that controls it. Over here is a function signpost. If we look at it, there's some mysterious text that happens to be the compiled assembly for the create bridge function. But if we take out our loop, we'll see the portal open up that allows us to enter the function directly. This room is procedurally generated from the assembly of the function, and these machines correspond to bits of the function's logic, fed by the data crystals on the left that represent constants and function arguments. Now, we can see here that there's a for loop that queues bridge tiles, but it terminates after four iterations. We can just set that constant to eight and walk out. The function will be rewritten on the fly, and when we trigger this pressure plate, our bridge will build further. By the end of the game, you'll have access to the code for everything, giving you tons of freedom to change the rules. Thank you.